Good morning, guys. Today is Friday, right? Yes. Happy Friday. It's Friday. It's the weekend. So we're excited about that. Oh, and I have good news for you guys. Remember, remember uh, we were choosing, trying to decide between the two houses, right? The one in my mom's area and the newer one, the last one we that we looked at that a lot of you guys liked. But didn't we vlog? Part two. Mm -hmm. mm, yeah. Yeah, so the last one that we looked at that a lot of you guys liked, that one that we were trying to decide between two, that one ended up selling for $55,000 over ask. Yeah. The agent just told us this morning. So, so we, it's good we didn't wait. It's good we didn't wait. We jumped on the, the one that felt like home to the boy. So we made the right choice. And that one ended up selling. Uh, we won it for $10,000 over ask as opposed to $55,000. is a big difference. So. Yeah, big time difference. Where I'm feeling even more, you know, happy with our decision and I'm looking forward to to moving into a bigger home. Yeah. It's exciting. Closing is July 29th, so... More people to come over for drinks. Yeah, exactly. We have two more months left in our condo and then... We'll be out of here. It's bittersweet, you guys. Yeah. Um, and I love condo living, but it's I'm excited for a new stage, you know? Yeah, something different. Yeah. I think... Wow. Yeah. Wow. We're hungry. Not really. So we decided to stop for lunch. I'm hungry. And we've never been here. It's called Taco Del Mar. It's actually inside Lowe's, but um, yeah, we decided to check it out, see what it's saying. Thank you, sir. <laughs> oh, it's cute in here. No. Hi. All right, so we got two ground beef tacos, two shredded beef tacos, and chips and salsa. So let's hope it's good. So yeah, that was um, that was a bust. Don't go there, guys. Yeah, um, maybe it's different in other locations, and we just got unlucky. The tacos were like half full. Mm-hmm. Um, and the tomatoes have cilantro on them. You have no choice. And the meat, they give you less meat than Taco Bell. Like less, I would say half the amount of meat that Taco Bell does. And Taco Bell is pretty stingy to begin with. Half the cheese, half the meat, half the everything. The thing was half full, like not even half. It was so bad that Tony was starving when she gave in, it came in there. We ordered two tacos each. She offered me her second taco. <laughs> yeah, don't go there. Don't go there, yeah. It's sorry, Taco Del Mar. We had high hopes. I know, it's so cute, and I'm a fan of tacos. I love tacos, so I was hopeful, but... Mm. Four tacos, so four regular-sized tacos. Think of Taco Bell tacos. And a bag, like a paper bag full of chips. That size, right? Half full as well. <laughs> Cost us uh, just under $17. Yeah. yeah. Crazy. So, and if it was really tasty, I would have been happy to pay the seventeen dollars. Yeah, or like you know, give me a taco that's got some like wow substance to it, like filled with meat and cheese and lettuce and stuff. Even the lettuce, he's just told, just fill it up. Like it's just lettuce. Anyways, enough ranting. Yeah. We are um, gonna head to my mom's house for a bit, hang out there. Yeah. We're back at home. I didn't end up going to my mom's house because I don't know. I just have a lot of stuff to do. So we decided to come back home. But I did stop at La Senza. The outlet in um, Ajax and I picked up a couple of bras because you guys my favorite bra broke today yeah it broke and it's my favorite bra and you know it's like you know how you have you'll have like a lot of bras but you only have like two in rotation because of your favorites yeah so I bought a couple of new ones cute right it's like leopard and black and then this one is just peach and then this one is um, beige. That's it. They're they're like ten bucks. Oh, and you know what I bought? They had this at the checkout. It's a shimmer mist, and it smells so good. Mm. It's like perfumed, but um, very very shimmery, as you can see. So I figured that would look really sexy on the legs in the summer. So I got that. That was like three ninety nine. And I got a package in the mail. Let's see what it is. I have a feeling I know what it is. 
It's basically a kimono that I ordered on eBay quite a while ago. But it took forever to get here. Cute, right? Just a long floral. Imagine this with a bandeau and some cutoff shorts. Smexy. Hey guys, today is Saturday. Yay, it's the weekend. It's Mother's Day weekend. So I think I'm going to go visit my mom today. Um, she really wants to go and get a pedicure, but I know that tomorrow the salons are going to be insane. So I figured I'd take her today instead. I have bad news, you guys. Not a fan. It just, I mean, it looks good when you put it on, but then five seconds later, boop. Like, it does not hold down my edges at all. Right now I'm trying to tie them down to see if that'll make a difference, but I don't know. My other edge controls, I don't have to tie them down, just does what it does, like my Design Essentials, which was my favorite, but the only thing is Design Essentials leaves that white sort of film, but it does work really well, so still on the hunt. It is a beautiful day, so I'm anxious to get outside and get it going. The boy is at the gym, and then he has a volleyball tournament later, so maybe I'll pop by and show you guys some of his moves, but for now... I'm gonna get dressed, see how this is looking, and get out of here. Okay, guys, we're in my mom's area, and in we're Whitby. going for yeah, Whitby. By the way, we're going for early Mother's Day treats. We found this nail salon. It's called VIP Nails and Spa. So we're gonna go inside. What are you getting done? Pedicure and manicure? Yes. That you picked. This is what my mom picked, natural looking pink color. And I think I'm gonna get this. It's like a mint green, but my mom likes this one better. So I don't know, they're pretty close though. I haven't decided yet. It's really pretty in here. So here's our spots. Right. Not too thin, right? Not too thin. Yeah. Okay. My mom's getting her eyebrows done. Okay, I decided to get the color that my mom picked for me. It's a little bit brighter and it's called Sure Enough by China Glaze. You can see how cute my toes look. You guys, it is the most beautiful day out today. It's just crazy. I really want to go sit on a patio somewhere and have like a tall, cold beer and just shoot the breeze with my girls but I got things to do today so right now I'm on my way over to Nadine's house we haven't seen her in a while so pay her a visit visit the girls and I got that bracelet made remember the bracelet that I hauled in my support assistant haul like the haul before last with her kids pictures on it so that's gonna be her Mother's Day gift from the girls so I gotta Sneak it in the girls' room so they can give it to her tomorrow. No, I was talking to her. No, I was Araya like, thinks she's talking on my phone. No, have the conversation. <laughs> Who's it? <laughs> Who are you talking to? <laughs> yeah. And then what happened? Oh. No pictures. No pictures. <laughs> that's my yawn it's well it's not super late but it's like 10 o'clock um i didn't vlog much at nadine's sorry guys i was just busy chatting and playing with the kids i forgot to pull out the camera more than once but i've been home for quite a long time i got home around five o'clock the boy was at volleyball and um i've just been working you can probably tell i'm surrounded by earrings you tell me you're supposed to come watch me play volleyball and you didn't no. Yeah. So what's up with that? <laughs> and I won the damn tournament. I know. Yay! Congratulations. No, forget it. High Seems five. Like, no. You get no fives. Zero fives. I won the tournament first time in my life. 
This girl didn't even come and watch it. Oh, I'm so sorry I missed it. You're supposed to be there. I know. I got caught up and then I just... You know you never watch me play volleyball? Yes, I do. No, you once, maybe. I've watched you play volleyball multiple times. So anyways, you guys, um, we're going to take a break. It's like 10 o'clock. Take a break. Um, get some air. It's a really nice night and we'll probably just go for a walk, take the dog out. and I probably will have a nightcap and then maybe get like a, an hour more or two of work in and call it a night tomorrow's mother's day so we're gonna go to his mom's for lunch happy mother's day to all the mothers out there uh, yeah happy mother's day to all the mothers it's not mother's day yet though and then um we're gonna go see my mom in the afternoon i saw her today though i just brought her to get a pedicure as you guys know because i knew that sunday the pedicure shops would be uh, swamped and I didn't want to you know wait and stuff like that so we went today and we had a nice day my toes look amazing balls see if I can see how flexible I am don't they look cute that's pretty much it guys hi guys today's Sunday happy Mother's Day to all the mamas Marley wished me a happy Mother's Day this morning, but she didn't get me Jack. Yeah, guys, we are in the west end of the city. And um, we're here to have lunch with his mom and his mom's husband and his mom's husband's mom. And his mom's husband's sister and husband, I believe, will also be here. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah, we're here to have lunch with them. And then after this, basically, we're going to go... Um, do a couple errands and then maybe go see my mom later. Um, he just stopped at this grocery store to pick up some flowers. I'm convinced that this grocery store does not have flowers because I'm almost, I'm 99.9% .9 sure that we had this exact conversation last year on Mother's Day. It's like deja vu because this grocery store is right by the restaurant we're going to. And he said, oh, I'm just going to stop at this grocery store to get flowers. I'm like, I don't think this kind of grocery store has flowers. It's not like a main, it's not like a big, you know, chain grocery store. It's just like this little, whatever, crappy grocery store. And I'm like, I don't think this grocery store is going to have flowers. He's like, yeah, yeah, they will. And then he came out empty handed and we had to go somewhere else. And I swear we had the exact same conversation just now. So I'm waiting to see if he's going to come out empty handed or if they got flowers this year. I don't know. Success. He found flowers, you guys. Yeah. I feel like the flowers, honestly, I looked at all of them and they look like they've been uh, fished out of the bin. <laughs> but I'm on there anyways. Oh, there they are. Oh, don't be nice. Get off the road. <laughs> what you doing? Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. Bye -bye. The old lady heart attack. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> well, I'm going to park. Yeah. Well, there's a spot right beside us. Oh, so where is there? Is there anywhere else that could park? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, we're obvious. <laughs> we're here. We're at Astoria. We just ran into them, so yeah, we're on time for once. Um, Astoria is a Greek restaurant. It's called Shish Kebab House, but it's good though. It's actually uh... it's delicious. I'm not really dressed up today. I'm casual, but I'm not a mother, so what else? Marley. Yeah, Marley's mama, Marley. Um, today's look of the day. This is the Gabriel way. I just gelled down my edges and put on like a little headband. It's a stocking, but I like it. It's cute. This is MAC Up The Amp. My eyeshadow is the Missy Lynn BH Cosmetics palette. You know, you guys know I've been killing that ever since I got it. And this little shawl I got from, I think it was Yes4, one of those Chinese kind of websites. Anyways, here we are. Astoria, it's like the darkness in the light. I'm pretty sure that's Disturbia. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Yes. Thank you. What's going on? You guys ready to go on a trip? It's Mother's Day 2.0. We're now at my mom's house. Um, yeah, we went to the restaurant for lunch and then we went back to his mom's place and just hung mom's out and, you know, had some um, 
tea and coffee and stuff like that. So we were there for a while. Now it's six o'clock, it's dinner time. So now... I just feel like I ate like five minutes ago. We are um, at my mom's house. So we're just waiting for her. Yeah. She went back to get her puffer because she's wheezing. Cause she's so excited to come out with us. Yeah. So we're going to take her for dinner to her favorite, one of her favorite restaurants. So I'm a little bit tired to be honest. So excuse okay. the lacklusterness. But yeah, same here. I look great though. Oh, I look terrible. I and I still look tired. Cute. My arms look huge in this thing. What are you tearing up my car for? Huh? <clears throat> are you tearing up my car door? <clears throat> no, we'd what? What'd you bring? Weed? Weed in the bag? <laughs> What's this bag here? What is that? In your hand. It's a Ziploc bag full of green stuff. My puffers. Yeah, okay, sure. You're going to be puffing on that. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have a look of fresh air, though? See, your windows don't work? No. You don't know how to, know how to use it? Oh, I have to do it myself. You're a grown woman. You want me to wind it down? <laughs> <laughs> Did you hire a driver? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with this woman? It's Mother's Day. It's not have a slave day. <laughs> Here we are at Tangerine Asian Cuisine. That's my mom's favorite restaurant. It's not even cold here. Well, one of them. Do you want to do an outfit of the day? Oh yeah, on it, on the comb. Just look at it. <laughs> Very nice. What about you? Outfit of the day? No. Oh, okay. yes, professor. Professor Spitfire. Why do I look like a professor? <laughs> I have a beard. <laughs> yeah. oh, that's right, that's right. Oh, my mom keeps calling the boy professor. <laughs> professor beard. <laughs> because of the beard. <laughs> Okay guys, so our spread is here. We've got it's steamed food, vegetables, though. fried rice, spicy deep fried fish, sesame chicken, and we have one more coming which is um, ginger, beef. ginger beef. It's not here yet though, but I'm too hungry, so we're gonna grow. Now for a break.